how are you? Welcome back. So today we're going to be doing a really quick fun video. I'm going to share with you all of the Fenty gloss bombs. So I'm going to swatch them all on my lips and then I'm also going to give you guys just like a quick little review. I thought it would be fun to share with you what they all look like with my skin tone and I'm a really big fan of the Fenty gloss bomb, the original one. So I thought it would be fun to try the other two. Maybe you guys haven't checked out the gloss bombs yet and since there's only three, you guys can see what all three of them look like and kind of pick the one that you like the best the next time you go shopping. So I just thought it would be fun and quick. Uh, so before we get into it guys, please make sure that you subscribe so you can stay updated whenever I upload new videos for you. And then also please be sure to come follow me on Instagram because I'm always on Instagram when I'm not on my channel. That's where you will always find me. Um, so yeah, let's just get into it. So just a quick overview for you guys. The gloss bombs retail for $18 each and they're marketed as universal lip luminizers. Now, the nice thing about that is that even though they have shades, the shade and pigmentation of each of the gloss bombs is nothing that's gonna compete with whatever you have on top of them. So they do pair really well with other lip colors and they also just look amazing on their own. The best thing, in my opinion, about the gloss bombs is that they give you a true wet, juicy, glass, super shiny finish to the lips and the sparkle to them is nothing that's ever gonna look frosty. They also have a really amazing XXL doe foot applicator, so just one pump and you can really swipe it all over the lips. Um, and the fragrance of these is peach vanilla, which is super addicting. So they're really great lip glosses. Some of my favorite, one of my favorite formulations ever, just because when I go for a gloss, I want something that's really gonna give just a wet, juicy, super reflective shine to the lips, which is what you do get with the gloss bombs. So let's get into the swatches. So the first one we'll swatch is the original Fenty Glow, which was the first one that launched. This one just kind of enhances your own natural lip color. I always like to put the gloss a little bit on the outside of my lip line. I just think it makes your lips look extra big. This is Fenty Gloss Balm in Fenty Glow, which is a really soft, rosy, glossy, golden gloss. <laughs> but, yep, original Fenty Glow. Next up is Diamond Milk, and because this one is so sheer and light in color, I did put a little bit of lip liner on. I used Urban Decay Liar, just so that you guys can still kind of see a shape of lips when I put this one on. So here, it's Diamond Milk. This one's more of a softer, pearlescent. Um, it's got noticeable silver glitter in it, but it's nothing like frosty. I think the key to this one, if you have more of a medium skin tone like myself, is to make sure that you go in with a lip liner just so that you can kind of still see the shape of your own lips and your lips don't just kind of lose themselves on your face. And then the last shade, the newest one, Fussy. I am excited to try this. This one is much more pink. And here's Fussy on the lips. Fussy is more pink than Fenty Glow. And it's also a little bit lighter and the actual shimmers of Fussy are much more fine. There's not really those super noticeable, chunkier shimmers that kind of twinkle. This is much more of a softer, luminous finish on the lips compared to Fenty. Not saying, these are all really sheer, so um, the Fenty one, when I say like the twinkling glitters, I just mean there's a little bit more shimmer in Fenty Glow that catches the light in a different way and kind of causes a little bit more of a twinkling effect. If I was shopping for the Fenty Gloss Bombs, I personally would wanna see Fenty Glow and Fussy side by side because they are similar when you look at the two, but Fussy is much more pink. And I'm gonna do half of these two lips with Fussy and half of these two lips with Fenty Glow, just so you guys can kind of see what I mean. Now with them side by side, I feel like you guys can really see what I'm saying. Fenty, which is this one right here, is a lot more rosy and golden undertoned, while Fussy is much more pink and slightly more pearlescent. They both still have that multi-dimensional shimmer where there's chunks of it that are slightly bigger and they kind of catch the light in a more twinkling effect, but I think Fenty has a little bit more of that twinkling effect, and Fenty is much more of just kind of a lip color reviver that really just makes your lip 
color look a little bit more enhanced, whereas fussy, a little bit more on the pink side. All right, guys, so that's it for this Fenty Gloss Bomb video. If there's something in regards to the gloss bombs that I didn't touch on, Feel free to hit me up in the comments because I'll always do my best to get back to every single one of you guys. Um, I just wanted to do this video super short and sweet, but I know with the gloss bombs, they're all you know, similar in a way and it could be kind of helpful for you guys to just see all of them on myself. Um, I really love the gloss bombs, would definitely recommend them. Um, and I thought this could be fun like comparing three or you know a low number of things that are really similar so that it's not overwhelming for you guys but with something like the gloss bombs you know you might not want all three you might just want one so i thought this could be really helpful for you guys um so i hope it was and if there's any other products that are really similar that you think it would be cool to see them compared side by side leave a comment down below let me know i'll always check them out and then if it's something that you guys really want to see i'll do a video on it for you so there will be product links and information in the description box down below for you guys as well as my snapchat instagram and twitter so please be sure to come follow me on there subscribe if you didn't earlier and i will see you guys in my next video thank you so much for watching this one bye guys